Well, we are back with an update on the Oliver Squaliver. Th that cat's named, one of those cats is named Oliver. Guess which one in the Triforce of Cat Pile. That's, that's Oliver Orange, Freaky Fried Eggs, because he had a previous owner that named him Rafiki, but I just call him Freaky Friday, and that's Fuzzy, because she's really fuzzy, and you guys know Sprugget. Hi, Sprugget. Blink. All right, guys, yeah, so I finished this Oliver. I, I got it all polished up and uh, draw band, mainspring set up. I took it all apart and, and cleaned it, and, and I think it types. It, it doesn't type super well, but I mean, it's, it's shiny, it's clean, it's complete. There was some rust damage on here that just wouldn't come off, so I did what I could to get the, the typewriter cleaned up. But we'll throw some paper in it, and we'll take a quick look. And you need like a, a sky crane for this typewriter. Probably have terrible lighting. Feed rollers are bad. Platten is bad. Ink is too wet. Catch. All right, I think the alignment's bad. Cool. Let's see what we got. It's my excuse the dirty dirtiness. This is the best this machine you get, but this is fine for now. See our little skips. Uh, I, I don't know if I have the draw band tight and tight enough on this. And this thing is cool, but I won't be writing a novel on it. <laughs> yeah, I won't be writing a novel on it. It's a little clunky. I'm, I'm sure I could tune it up better and align it better but it's it's neat and it's interesting to work on and the, uh, the the way that the carriage advance works is is interesting too but I think once I get this dialed in it'll be a typer but it's cool I like it anyway guys this was my I, I was supposed to do this on Sunday, but I had some downtime because I'm waiting for some paint supplies to come in. So I figured, hey, why not? I'll just finish up this Oliver. But man, look at these feed rollers are terrible, terrible crusted. The platen is so old and dead, it's blue. Can you see the tinted blue? I mean, it's literally blue diamond. And this was all rusted. So I just uh, took it to the bench grinder and wire wheeled all this. So it's not chrome plated. It's just brushed metal right now with oil, so it won't uh, rust. But eventually, I'll, I might get this all re-chromed again because that would be neat. But you know, I, I don't know if I'm into the, the machine enough to, to do a full-on restoration. I got it typing, and it'll be a pretty thing to look at. And, uh, you know, it's my Oliver story. All right, guys. Hot Rod Typewriter Company. Talk to you later.